Hey everyone, this is Chris with Spy Living. Today I'm gonna do a review of this little guy here. This is the Hario Skirtin Plus. It's a ceramic coffee mill, manual coffee mill. Now, to understand where I'm coming from, I was down uh, traveling for about a week to see family members down in Florida and uh, my mom did not have a coffee grinder and I prefer a, a burr grinder because the grind is that much more uh, consistent. So uh, let's take a look at first what you get when you open this up. These run about $35 from Amazon and I'll leave links below. And you can see I've already used it. So you have this little thing that sits on here, protects the glass. You have this, that, uh, which goes over the top. You've got the handle, and this is a lid for the, for the glass right here. But essentially what you do when you want to adjust the burrs right here is you take off this little thing right here, pull out this, and twist it down. And it, what we'll do is as you, as you twist it, it allows it to open up, right? Or to close down, right? And so once you've kind of figured out where it is, you go ahead and add this back on. You then add on uh, the arm here and go ahead and put this back on. And what you can do then is you can actually screw it on top of here. And when you grind, it will come into here. This right here means it won't fall out and then this is obviously a lid. So here's the thing is, I think it does a great job at grinding, but this is not to me a long-term solution because it is a pain in the ass to use, right? Um, it will take you five, six minutes of, and the funny thing is you get to work out on your shoulders, believe it or not, you know, and if you, when we were doing it, we were doing multiple cups a day and you know, it worked fine. I think this is a great travel companion, uh, but I would spend a little extra money. Like uh, I just uh, I just bought a new Baratza Encore burr grinder, which is significantly better, but this would work just fine. So let me go ahead and grab some coffee real quick and you can see exactly what this does. Okay, so I got a plate here just so you can see. And uh, I'm using a, a Brazil Cerrado single origin from Toy Dog Coffee. And so if we just, I'm just going to do a little bit in here just so you can kind of see how this works. Right, pop her down and Now you can see if you had an electric burr grinder, this would be significantly faster. And so that's all I'm gonna do at the moment here. So I'm gonna take this off and you're gonna see, and this is maybe a little bit fine here, but you can see Nice, consistent grind, not the big chunks that you normally get from, let's say, a stick grinder. It just has a little blade that sticks around. Um, this actually works quite well. You get a good quality grind with good quality coffee, and when you're traveling, this may be the way to go. Would I use this every single day? No, no. I'll spend, I'll spend a few extra dollars. I'll spend the 60 or, or 100 extra dollars to get the, the electric burr grinder, but this was perfect for getting good quality coffee that you could travel with 
it stores away really easily. The burrs are ceramic. And you know, outside of it taking you five minutes to, to grind, it actually does a really good job. So um, who is this for? If you're traveling, perfect for you. If you have a really, really tight budget, like you know, this was I think 30 or $35 on Amazon, then this might be for you as well, right? Especially if you're just doing pour over or if you're maybe just doing a French press, uh, it gives you the flexibility without having to spend the money. But you know, to be honest, if, if you can afford an extra $100, you know, as long as you're not doing espresso with the brazza, I would look at doing that. But yeah, I mean, can I recommend it? With reservations, I wouldn't use this as an everyday thing. I think you spend, you save up a little extra money to get uh, an electric one, but for traveling or for going over to friends and families or anything, this thing works wonderful. So if you wanna go ahead and get one of these yourselves, I will leave a link on, um, I will leave a link in the description below over to Amazon where I got this from, as well as I'll leave a link to the coffee uh, that I got uh, from Toy Dog Coffee, this Brazil Cerrado. And hopefully you got a lot out of this and it helps you make a decision of whether you're going to go ahead and uh, buy this for yourself. So other than that, look forward to seeing you in another video and bye for now. Thank you.